secret, I think. Uh, so do you think IG needs to switch this up immediately? Put Brood bottom? I don't know if they need to do it immediately, but they need to get something done with their supports. Looks oh, like they, wow, will they be doing really want Zai. Chuan gonna block him off. Oh, wait, never what? mind. Slippery. Just gonna let him pass. He gets the stun off. Faith, disruption is available. Burning wants to block him in with his Berserker's call. And here we go. This might be the first blood. Zai taking a lot of damage. Another LSA to come. And first blood goes the way of IG. They are on the board first. And who got that? That was Shadow Demon, actually. Yeah, Faith picks it up. Nice opportunity to get the call with the creep. They have rotation from IG looking to stop this push. Disruption oh, really onto S4 into an LSA. Seeing Luo do a little bit of damage to S4. He's going to have to back off, though, because the damage is absolutely ridiculous with the soul assumption from Kuroki and whatnot. Ferrari They're gonna trying to go for S4. They're going to get the kill one way or another. The deny will not be there. <laughs> Queen of Pain getting the last hit there, and Kuroki. On the run. That was pretty funny. There were like three heroes completely mistiming the last hit there. Ferrari has <laughs> blinks. It's one of the longest blinks in the game. He's just got the brood up here. One one. Uh, to answer your question about Legion, I don't know if if a uh, blink first is the right call here. I think maybe Zai wants to tank up a little bit. Maybe looking for treads. Uh, perhaps disruption blade bottom million. again. Into Soulcatcher burning with the call. S4. Oh, LSA will miss, but it might not matter. Graves going to save him, at least for now. Burning on the run, oh, taking the liquid Blade fire. Too. What wow. a disaster. Big turnaround for Secret. And Chuan on the run, taking a soul assumption. Couple more right clicks will take him out, and that's a two for nothing. And S4 lives on the Jakiro. Those, they not that they're that far behind, but... They don't really have a very good late game. No, that's the problem. RTZ taking a Shadow Strike. Sonic Wave going to try to deny himself. Not going to happen. Oof. Got excited for nothing. <laughs> Typical. Yep. Nation and then taking the base. Well, incapacitating bite is no longer an orb effect, so, you know, you can That's get that deso. Holy shit, the damage oh, from Zai. Man, Zai I is going to give up damage to Ferrari. I think he would have won that duel if he dueled Luo. He dueled the hero that mm -hmm. has way, had way more health than the other one. Look to continue onto the tier two. Zai, in the meantime, taking more harassment uh, damage, Shadow Strike. Doesn't look like Luo wants to help with this. He's pretty low. Going to go for the tower first. Now Zai on the run, getting slowed a bit. Ferrari doesn't have much mana to speak of, though. He's going to take a Brute. Oh, is that going to be oh. enough? Unbelievable. Yeah. And they're going to smoke up right off the bat, too. So Faith and Burning looking for a kill. Tranquil's going to heal up Burning. Mm. Kuroki and Arteezy better be careful. Burning with the blink comes in, going for Arteezy. And a Sonic Wave, sure and sure the kill. And even the Culling Blade is popped for the death. And Kuroki will be the second one to go. And unfortunately for Secret, they're getting mauled over now. S4 came in for TP support, Soul Catcher. There's the Calling Blade counter to the Grave yet again coming into play. And with that speed boost, which is probably uh, arguably one of the more important parts of that skip. Interesting. On Visage? On the co-op, so he wants, to, oh. uh, he wants to fight early. Yeah, so the cooldown was at 40 second cooldown at, uh, with the Ags as S4 is going to get initiated upon after using his ult. And down he goes to the Laguna Blade, burning saved by the disruption. Might be in some trouble though, and down he'll go to the Soul Assumption. So it's a one for two in the end. Or is it the end? Ferrari looking for some more. 30 second cooldown with Sonic Wave. Meanwhile, top lane, Zai getting chased by Luo, who's going to think better of it as he gets dusted. RTZ a little bit too late to the party. And Luo will be fine. They got their tier one mid lane. Oh, they Ferrari. got a kills. They could get more Ferrari. Doesn't have blink down. for four seconds. Nope, too oh. far, but Soul Assumption is not going to be enough. He was bottling along the way. It's absolutely insane yeah. how good their lineup is for it. Shadow Wave with Medallion with the birds, so you always have multiple targets. Yeah. And of course, the Drow for everything. Arteezy taking LSA and a Sonic Wave. A Laguna Blade will finish off the, the Legion Commander. Culling Blade takes care of the Aegis, but back will come Arteezy. Ferrari stuck in the midst of a bunch of birds. Will drop as a result. It's a one for one, not including the Aegis. But the Ancient stack was taken out for the most by Secret as buyback now on Zai. Looking for oh. some defense mm. against... Oh, wow. That's not that much gold when he bought back. Oh, that's right. It's 40%, right? Kuroki getting initiated upon LSA to follow. And Culling Blade is available. He's not quite low enough. The urn, will it be enough to get him low? He could duck him now. He's he doing work everywhere oh, else. Oh, nice heal the last second for Puppy. He's going to put oh, that bad boy bird. on cooldown. Kuroki slowing, burning a little bit more. Oh Gets great, and God. somehow they find the kill. Oh. What level is burning? Is he 10 or 11 on Axe? He's 10, yeah. Oh, that we would see Broods even pick up something like a Diffusal Blade. Help with the slow. You can purge off a of dust. But not something many of them really consider. And it's true. I agree. The defensive purge is, is pretty cool for Brood. Yeah. It's very true. But Necro and Orchid. And oh, jump Kuroki in. taking okay. a call. LSA Sonic oh Wave. They certainly got the revenge there. Whoa. <laughs> That's a lot of spells. No All doubt right, about got it. Him.
Top lane, there we have a duel. Zai taking a lot of damage. He might go down, and another duel lost, this time to Luo, who will apply all his pressure to Arteezy. Oh He's going to get a double kill if he's not careful. And with the Shadow Demon help, should be enough. And things not looking good for Secret now as S4 gets the Ice Path. Macropire only onto one. He takes a Laguna Blade to the back of the head. And that's four dead in favor of IG. And Puppy oh, going to be comes. the last to fall. A dunk will finish him off. It's a team wipe. IG looking completely different in this game. Can we get a really solid choice? It's a way for... He can more or less guarantee that Jakiro takes the last will damage. As, uh -oh. oh, we have Yules into Macropire. Ice Path as well. Gust will connect. And it's going to be enough to take out Faith. But that's duel, all for duel. Faith. I hear a duel. Hear the bongos coming. Nobody's going to win this one. They do get the kill, but no damage goes the way of Zai. And that was about half a second too late. Thing porting first. And okay, multiple Oh, ports. they're going. Defensive weave already out. They're committing for this. This is the peaking window right now for your typical Visage Drow lineup, that 20 to 30 minute oh. mark. Burning jumps jump in, in on the puppy. We have a Zai duel on Chuan, but there's a disruption. The nice counter. Axe does die, buys back into the game. Laguna Blade. Not enough damage taken away, but in fact, the Lina is the one that died. Faith taking a ton of damage from Kuroki. Only one buyback to come out from IG. Like we said, it was the Axe. I believe that was the gem taken out. Uh oh. Raindrax, finally, Luo comes to the rescue in the mid lane at his own base. Stunned a little bit too late from Visage. And Secret's going to go back. Pretty much happy with that exchange. Although they did give up the range racks. That's not that big of a deal in the end. He's 1,500? I think no, he has one component on the courier. Or? Or is he flat? He might be flat 2k. Just 3k then. No, 3k. Like, well, this is a really big fight that's going to happen right now. Oh. You heard it here first. A big fight's about to occur. Thanks, Sender, for the inside burning. Jumps in on Arteezy. Is going to be enough to take him out before anything happens? He pops his BKB, though, trying to create some space so he can get that damage. Faith goes down to Zai, who finally gets his first duel win of the game. Actually, maybe that's the second one. Luo, in the meantime, trying to finish off the Dazzle, but he gets four-stepped on top of the cliff and four dead for IG. And this is going to be a free rush for Secret. See, it and was a big fight. Jump. Thanks, smartass. So unlikely to come out as an IG victory. This Rax is going to go down so fast. And here's the duel with double damage from Zai. Disruption going to pretty much counter the right off the bat. He's going to get enough. He's going to get the kill, but it's not enough for the damage. However, Ferrari getting initiated upon. Graves going to save Zai. The dive continues. And look at this damage from Secret. Unbelievable. They're going to take out this Rax pretty much no problem. And just like that, they're back in this game, if not leading. One Roche fight. There's the Yules. Ice Path with the Visage Familiar stunned on top. Soul Assumption finishes off the Queen of Pain. And Secret's going to be quite happy with that. Is it going to attempt to fall back? Zero gold difference at this point. Like, Brood is not a strong hero at this point in time for fighting. Yep. No, Arteezy oh. still has the Aegis. Keep in mind, S4 initiated upon. He's going to be the first to fall. Quap died as well. Bought back. Zai in the meantime. Oh. Trying okay. to get a damage thing, but well, winner again for Ferrari, but how much is that going to matter? Arteezy on the run with the BKB still has the Aegis in stow. That's three dead for Secret. He's going to attempt to TP out, but the disruption is there. They should be able to clean him up twice. All right, caster easy. curse. He, I was caster <laughs> curse, out of curse dude. You did it. Easiest caster curse of my life. Meanwhile, I don't think IG lane, can win with zero Top lane difference. for Secret. The oh. creeps might get it. this actual wreck. Is this possible? Zai buys back. Problem. All right, he's going to save it. Cardi the catapult, not going to be enough. Go, but you can get maybe second to a Vlad's. I don't know if they have one. Because if they don't, I would have liked to see that. Oh, Arteezy. Oh, no, it's Burning. He's going to initiate with the BKB onto S4, LSA, and Laguna Blade, and Coing Blade. Used to take out that poor Jakiro. Meantime, Arteezy pops the BKB himself. Sonic Wave will go to three. Lua on the run with the BKB activated as well. Here comes the counter initiation. Bernie yet again on top of Arteezy. The grave isn't going to be enough. They're going to take out the axe before we can call him Blade. Chuan goes down as well. It's a three for one with the one buyback from Secret. Ferrari. You're going to be able to clear out this Rax if nothing is done about it. Well, they fall back for now. Burning. Bought back again. This is his second buyback, if I'm not mistaken. He's going to shoot upon Puppy, but there's the Yules. Sonic Wave again up. Zai gets the duel off. Is this going to be enough damage to get anybody with the damage? Uh, burning will fall. That's the buyback down, and Brood will fall. Damage doesn't go anybody's way, but it doesn't really matter. The death is all that matters here, and the Rax looks to be secrets again. Second lane of Rax. No buyback for Burning. Do they just go for Megas? Uh, there's a tier 2 top still. They could just go for Throne, perhaps. It's possible they could try to Throne this. Oh, man. There's a lot of big abilities for IG that are down for a little bit. I guess Sonic Wave will be available soon. As 
They are looking to try for the tier 4, so this could backfire, but no axe for 40 seconds. You know, I was surprised IG actually initiated on that. They had like 15 seconds to go before they had a 5-on-5. Five five. They initiated into a 3-on-5 there with the buyback from Axe. And just took a, a fight with lower numbers, which again seems uncharacteristic. Perhaps the last stand for IG as Zai looking for a duel, but the Yules will counter him. Chuan available. Doesn't even bother. He's just going to get the kill the old-fashioned way. Luo in the meantime going upon Arteezy. There's the duel to finish off the spider. Arteezy graved. And this looks to be the end of IG in this first series. Secret, gonna take this 2-0, and this game was back and forth. This is what we were waiting for, this game. Man, such a close game, and still 32 <laughs> minutes. <laughs> it was a close but, game. I mean, yeah. This is the first game we've had in the tournament that wasn't... Am I right? Yeah, this is the first game in the tournament so far that wasn't ridiculously one-sided. Yeah. It's still a 32-minute GG, but that's just the... like. The way line, the way secrets line up.